robotic assisted gynae surgeries in benign gynae diseases have a definite advantage. I am Dr. Anuradha Kapoor, Senior Director and Head of Unit at Max Smart Super Speciality Hospital, Department of Obs and Gynae. We all know that minimally invasive surgeries have very good advantages for the patient, like less pain, quicker recovery, and less blood loss, and cosmetically also they are better. But robotic assisted surgeries have advantages over the conventional laparoscopy. First of all, they have a 3D camera. So that means that visualization is much better. There is better dissection, there is more accuracy. So there's less tissue destruction and damage and patient has less post-op pain. There's also tremor filtration. Then there's an endoris movement. That means the arms can move in seven directions instead of the conventional laparoscopy, which has only four movements. So you can access in deep complex surgeries like deep pelvic endometriosis, and other surgeries, robotic assisted surgeries become better. So robotic assisted surgeries have an advantages in patients who are very obese, who have large multiple fibroids in deep pelvic endometriosis and in sacrocolpopexy. To give an example, if somebody has multiple fibroids, large fibroids, posteriorly placed fibroids, conventional laparoscopy can sometimes become very difficult, especially the suturing and infertility can become an issue. But if you do robotic assisted surgeries, because there's a 3D camera and you're in control of the camera, then the suturing is much easier, it is better, and there is no fertility issue. So especially in uh, hysterectomies in which there are large obese patients, they have large fibroids, there are multiple adhesions, and in those patients also it has been found that robotic assisted hysterectomies are much better. In deep pelvic endometriosis, when there's a lot of scarring and there's a lot of tissue damage and there's distortion of anatomy, it has been found that robotic assisted surgeries have a definite place because of the 3D camera, the tremor infiltration, because of the endorist movement, and because of the better ergonomics for the surgeon, they can do these complex surgeries, prolonged surgeries in a much more efficient way. Similarly for sacrocolpopexy, for pelvic floor repair. So robotic assisted surgeries have a better outcome in patients who want a hysterectomy, who are obese and with pelvic adhesions and large fibroids, also in myomectomies with multiple fibroids, in deep pelvic endometriosis and in sacrocolpopexy. I hope you found this video informative. If you have any queries or questions, please drop them in the comment box below. Thank you. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest healthcare updates.